Hi everyone, welcome back to the new video of GK Study YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about the important kind of questions and answers of the day, 19 April 2022. Okay, let's start the section. First question. When is World Heritage Day observed? Okay, the answer for the question is option B, April 18th. Okay, the World Heritage Day is observed annually on April 18th. Okay, let's see about the World Heritage Day. The International Day for Monuments and Sites, also known as World Heritage Day, is an international observance held on 18th April. The day was first observed first in 1983 by United Nations Educational Scientific and Cultural Organization that is UNESCO. It gained recognition as a world event during the 22nd General Conference of UNESCO. The theme for World Heritage Day 2022 is Heritage and Climate. Okay, you have to note on that. The World Heritage Day is observed annually on 18th April. And the theme for 2022 is Heritage and climate. Okay, let's see the world heritage sites in India. India is home to a total of 3,691 monuments and sites. Of these, 40 are designated as UNESCO World Heritage Sites, including places like the Taj Mahal, Ajanta Caves, and Ellora Caves. World heritage sites also include natural sites like the Kaziranga National Park in Assam. Okay, that's about the World Heritage Day and the World Heritage Sites in India. Okay, let's see next question. Which is the first state to develop migration tracking system that is MDS application? Okay, the answer for the question is option C, Maharashtra. Okay, let's see about the MDS application. In a first of its kind project in the country, the Maharashtra government has developed a website-based migration tracking system that is MDS application to map the movement of vulnerable seasonal migrant workers through individual unit unique and identity numbers the state government's women and child development department launched it say it as a pilot project in november last year in six districts with high tribal population including Gadchiroli, chandrapur amravati amravati jalna palgar and nandurbar the mds project is envisaged to maintain the country of sorry continuity of the integrated child development services that is icds like nutrition supply immunization and health checkup etc to migrate beneficiaries including children aged up to 18 years lactating mothers and pregnant women registered with the anganwadi centers okay that's about the mds application of maharashtra government okay that's the answer for the question okay let's see next question bahag bihu or rongali bihu is one of the biggest festivals of which state falls in the second week of April every year. Okay, the answer for the question is option B, Assam. Okay, let's see about the word Rangali Bihu. Bahag Bihu or Rangali Bihu is one of the biggest festival of Assam, falls in the second week of April every year, marking the beginning of the harvest period. This year, Bahag Bihu is observed from April 14 to April 16. On this day, farmers take their cows, cows to a pond or a river to give them a bath before applying ma, a mixture of a mixture made of turmeric powder and pulses. Okay, that's about the festival Rangali Bihu or Bohag Bihu. Okay, let's see next question. Which Indian state was announced to celebrate the birth anniversary of Dr. Ambeko on April 14 as Equality Day? Okay, the answer for the question is option D, Tamil Nadu. Okay, let's see about this. Tamil Nadu Chief Minister M.K. Stalin announced in the Legislative Assembly that the birth anniversary of Dr. Ambeko on April 14 would be celebrated as Equality Day from this year. The Chief Minister said that a pledge would also be taken across the state on the day. The government also plans to translate and publish some of the selected books of Ambeko in Tamil. Okay, that's about the Equality Day by the Tamil Nadu government. Okay, let's see next question. Who has been conferred with the International Gandhi Awards for Leprosy 2021 in the individual category? Answer for the question is option A, Fush and Kumar. Okay, let's see about this award. Vice President of India, M. Venkai Naidu has presented the International Gandhi Awards for Leprosy 2021 to Dr. Fush and Kumar of Chandika under the Indian nomination individual category and Sahyo Kusa Yekne Trust, Gujarat under the institutional category okay let's see about the international gandhi awards for leprosy award the annual award has been instituted by gandhi memorial leprosy foundation to recognize the work of individuals and organization who have worked tirelessly to fight the disease and the prejudices associated with it 
the award commemorates the compassion that gandhi possessed and the service he rendered towards people afflicted with leprosy okay that's about the gandhi award for leprosy 2021 okay let's see next question neptune missile system which was seen in the news re recently is associated with which country and so for the question is option b ukraine okay let's see about the neptune missile system in black sea fleet moskva sank off the coast of odessa after a missile strike on the ship russians claim that an onboard ammunition fire caused by the blast on the ship while the ukrainian stated that it was a planned strike using the neptune and ship cruise missiles the neptune missile system was inducted into the ukrainian forces in 2021 after russian threats to the coastal areas of ukraine was growing rapidly since occupation of crimea in 2014 Neptune is a coastal and ship cruise missile which is capable of destruction of naval vessels in a range of 300 km. Okay that's about the Neptune missile system. Okay let's see next question. When is the Himachal Divas celebrated in India? And so for the question is option B April 15. Okay let's see about the Himachal Divas. Himachal Day is observed on the 15th of April in Himachal Pradesh. The state became a full fledged state on this day. Four district of Mandi, Shampa, Mahazu, Mahazu, and Sirmore were integrated with over two dozen princely states, leading to the formation of Himachal Pradesh as a union territory in 1948. Decades later, in 1971, Himachal Pradesh became the 18th state in India with Shimla as its capital. Okay, that's a that's about the Himachal Divas. Okay, let's see some points about Himachal Pradesh. Okay, we can see here the location of Himachal Pradesh. That is. in the red color okay the summer capital of himachal pradesh is shimla and the winter capital of himachal pradesh is dharamshala and the number of district of himachal pradesh is 12 okay we have already done a video about the states of india in our youtube channel okay we'll give the link in the description given below you can check that and watch the video okay this is the last question of the today's kind of quiz video okay in this video we are discuss about the important kind of quiz questions and answers of the day 19 april 2022 for all competitive examinations okay i think it's understood about section if you have any doubts related to any question and its answer please comment down in the comment section given below we will discuss that okay thank you for watching this video keep supporting us see you tomorrow with a new video on kind of quiz and other study topics thank you bye bye